Hey YouTube, so I'm just making uh, this little update or whatever. So, <clears throat> um, I just got out of a flare-up. The flare-up lasted for about, um, i say about maybe 10 days. Mm, no, 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 i say maybe 7 to 10 days. And... I've came up with like an exact, um, I guess you could say description of how my joints feel when I'm in a flare up. So like my hips, when they hurt when I'm in a flare up, it's like my hips feel like, you know how it feels when you like, um, when you hit your funny bone? Well, that's how my hips feel when I'm in a flare up. But it never feels like I stop hitting my funny bone. It's just constantly. And that's how my lower back feels also. So my hips and my lower back feel like I'm constantly hitting my funny bone, but it's in those areas. Now, in my knuckles and everywhere else, my shoulders and everything, my ankles, my knees, it feels like paper cuts and Bengay. It doesn't feel good at all. And that just went on for five, I'm sorry, seven to 10 days. And then I felt like I was kind of coming out of it. And then I think I had a little bit too much sugar for the past few days. And today I'm not feeling all that high either. Now today I did take like 1600 milligrams of ibuprofen. So I'm feeling a little bit better. I did take, I put, um, I put something called Elemis. My fiance got it off of a cruise. So that oil helps. And then I took some lemongrass and some copaiba oil. So those are feeling, you know, so those pretty much help me. Um, so I'm feeling a little better. And right now it is, it's 4.02 in the afternoon. Uh, this morning when I woke up around 8, 8.30, I didn't want to get out of bed. Uh, I wanted to get some more sleep. But um, we had to go to the car dealership because when we went out of town, a piece of tire from, I guess, a truck or 18-wheeler or whatever flew up under the car. So we had to get that done this morning, but I just did not want to go. My wrists were hurting. I was just really, really achy. And it seemed like it was going to rain today. And I just didn't feel good. So I feel a little bit better right now. I think I'm, I would say probably about pain level, probably about a three right now. But earlier today, it was like a six, six, seven. It wasn't good. And during my flare up, the pain is like a seven, eight. But it really doesn't go away like that it kind of just goes from joint to joint from joint to joint today it was more of like stable in certain areas so I don't really feel like it was a flare-up I feel like maybe it was maybe because I had a little bit too much sugar um so I don't know but I do believe the hydroxychloroquine is actually working so I just wanted to report that but you know what autoimmune diseases it's like you could be on the best medication in the world and some you just gonna have bad days and um oh yeah i went to the doctor because i've been having some problems with my eyes and he upped my dosage on the um zonisamide from 125 to 150 so my eyes are feeling better i'm not having as much blurriness or as much pain and I got to go see him again on the 27th. So hopefully, um, but my pressure was good in my eyes. Like my pressure was like 15 and 16 in the eyes. So hopefully it's lower, but I definitely was kind of having, you know, some more consistent pain and blurriness, more visual disturbances. So he upped the medication. So I'm feeling better as far as my eyes are concerned. I haven't had <clears throat> any um, migraine headaches or, I mean, well, it's not really a migraine. You won't. I can't really explain it unless you have IIH. You would know what I'm talking about. So that's all I have to report. Have a good day.